Good morning. Uh, hi, I'm Bob Elpers, golf coach at St. John's, and uh, Ryan Klinkner has invited me to uh, have an opportunity to talk about our spring season and our trip to Hershey, Pennsylvania for the national tournament. I'm a little bit anxious about this because he said this was going to be more of a 60-minute hard-hitting uh, interview kind of a uh, format than usually when I just uh, start babbling. But uh, we leave tomorrow. We uh, head out to Hershey, Pennsylvania. Uh, fly into Harrisburg and then uh, grab the van and head the rest of the way to Hershey. We've got a great bunch of kids that uh, are on the team total. We had 12 guys uh, total. This is always a little bit of a bittersweet experience actually for, for uh, the old coach where you have to trim your roster to five because uh, they, they all uh, played hard enough and well enough to earn an opportunity to play. But the five that have kind of uh, separated themselves a little bit and have just done a terrific job are uh, senior Ben Bangsness from Alexandria. Uh, junior Ben Cahill from Grand Rapids, uh, sophomore Tony Krogan from Marshall, and freshman Dennis Granith from Sweden, and uh, Mark Georgie from Red Wing. Uh, Dennis has come back from an injury. Alex Clare played most of the uh, spring season on the first team, and, and uh, Alex is from Mankato. He's a sophomore and just did a spectacular job. Uh, but uh, Dennis is healthy and, and playing great, and uh, really looking forward to, to what those <laughs> what those five guys can do. They're kind of a loose bunch there, uh, so I, I, I'm excited. Even though we're young, I think uh, I think they're going to step up, and I think they're really going to do a heck of a job. We're playing at two golf courses. We're playing at the Hershey Country Club and the Hershey Links. What happens at the national tournament is there are 35 teams that uh, make up the field and five individuals that are selected from schools all over the country from teams that didn't get in. Uh, half of the field will play at Hershey Links, and then half of the field will play at the Hershey Country Club, and then you'll flip-flop. So each uh, school will get one opportunity to play each of the two golf courses. Then there's a cut uh, for the top 23 teams and five individuals. That'll happen after Wednesday's round, after 36 holes, and then the final two rounds will be at, uh, at Hershey Links. All we know is what we've seen on the Internet, and uh, those courses, look, they look terrific, and they look tough. And uh, I, I think that I think that's all right for us because uh, I mean the kinds of this spring was was terrific, but you know it's never perfect golf weather up here in the north. And I think uh, looking at the forecast, Hershey's going to be a lot like Minnesota, and uh, I think we're, we're looking forward to that. Uh, tougher the course, uh, I, I think uh, I think it helps our kids a little bit. We're used to playing in tough conditions.